Nunavut Housing needs to build 3,000 homes to alleviate overcrowding and long wait lists. With new units running $450,000 apiece, it's a slow process, leaving entire families homeless. We have uh, not enough places for people to live, so often you may even have 16 people living in a three-bedroom house. And uh, there's a lot of uh, friction and frustration that, that occurs in, in, a, in that type of situation. And sometimes, unfortunately, it uh, plays out in, you know, high rates of violence. This is ballpark. It needs $1.5 to $2 billion of inf infrastructure now for houses, schools, health centers, airports. Uh, roads. How are you going to ever address that with $120 million capital? Not only homes to build, but homes to fix. Many with sagging floors, foul air, and walls bearing the marks of deep frustration. Why can't the federal government work on the territory before they spend, what, $16 billion on jets for fighting people? Why don't they have $2.2 billion to build houses here? There's so many elements, you know, that people are suffering and they need help and they need these support mechanisms to overcome some of their problems so that they can not only help themselves but help their families and that we can actually become a healthier society.